Howdy folks and welcome back to another amazing episode of Mongocide's Modern Mayhem with me, the perfect host for this exact type of show. Whatever type of show you want to consider it is your choice. I will never tell you that you're wrong unless you're wrong. Um, today's topic, birds are for the birds. Now, I love birds from a distance. I love admiring them, listening to their musical vocalizations. They can be beautiful. They are very interesting to watch. I am not a fan of birds as pets. Not that I'm not that I'm talking for everyone else. I'm simply saying for me, I don't like birds as pets. I've been through that once. Uh was a little much for my eardrums. And that's okay. That is not the bird's fault. That's simply my personal preference. It's all pets have their issues, their downsides, and up to and their upsides. I can think of a little wide variety of downsides for my beloved cats. Even my dear Princess Nine Biscuit Fuzzball that cameos on occasion. So like I said, I'm not denigrating your personal choice of cats if, or rather pets, your personal choice of pets if birds are one of your favorites and preferred feathery companions. More power to you. But my peace does not lie with pet birds, simply the occasional bird watching. And not official, I wouldn't call it bird watching. That takes more energy than I personally care to invest, such as life. Uh, I hope you, if you care to and feel the desire and are open to it, feel free to comment your personal favorite sorts of pets. Mine are. Alas, I suppose a little vanilla, cats and dogs, not necessarily in that order. Although perhaps in that order, you know, I love my good buddy, all right? She's the best. From there, I have had the occasional ferret, awesome pets. Anyways, I'm done with this topic. Good night, God bless, and catch you all another time.